I live about five minutes away, so this one's a little bit easier for me. We're so glad you're all here tonight. Uh, we have some people from very far. Where's Elijah? Right here. Yeah, just moved here from where? Where did you live? Glendale, Arizona. Arizona just sold her house like two weeks ago and made the drive across, got in Florida hours ago, and is a new Floridian. Oh, yes. Uh, we have a number of new Floridians in the room. Raise your hands if you just moved to Florida in the last three months. Raise your hands, raise your hands. Yep, there, there. Super, where's Melissa? There we go. Oh, I was born here. You were born here. All right. Well, welcome everybody. We're so glad that you're here. For those of you who don't know, my name is Rachel Garcia. Let me ask a quick question before I get started. How many of you have never, you don't even know what you're here for? Somebody told you to come, do a friend favor, and you're, you've never seen anything. I would just like to know. Angie, put your hand up. Anybody? You've all seen something before. You have an idea. Kelly, you've seen something? Yes. Okay, you have an idea of what you're here for. Great. So um, I'm going to be sharing some information tonight that I think will, it, it has the potential to be life-changing. And you're going to hear some people tonight talk about how they were told this could be life-changing and they rolled their eyes. I was one of those people. So um, I found out about this in 2008. For those of you that don't know my story, I'm a physician assistant. I was practicing medicine in Ponte Vedra uh, full-time. Full-time as a physician assistant means you're at the office by seven and you see patients till seven and then you finish filling out charts until about 11 o'clock at night. I was very busy. I never got to see my kids. I had two babies at the time and I had a nanny raising them who they called mom. And that made me cry all the time because I had multiple miscarriages before my first child. And so I would be in the OR and Teresa would be working with me and I'd be sewing and I'd be thinking, am I gonna miss every Friday field trip? Is this gonna be the rest of my life? And I started thinking, what can I do to get free? Now, some people are like, well, just quit your job. Just quit your job and be home with your kids. Why didn't you just do that? Well, I went to school at the University of Florida for four years. I then got into the PA, I got into medical school and freaked out last minute and said, I don't wanna to go to school for 12 years. <laughs> it's a long time. I didn't wanna go be a PA, whatever that is. Um, and so it took me two years to get into PA school. So I got into PA school, went down to Miami, dragged my poor husband, who did not wanna to go to Miami, kicking and screaming, and went through a two-year program, got my master's degree, got board certified to practice medicine as a PA, and chose a specialty that pays more than most physicians make, okay? With no call. So I was paid very well. So to just say, oh, well, just quit your job and stay at home with the kids. Yeah, no, I made more than most doctors make. So. I'm sitting there thinking, how can I make money on the side while I'm here so that I can be home with my kids on Fridays at some point in the future? And so I started thinking, like, you guys have all thought this. I'm thinking most people here have thought this way before. Like, how can I make money on the side? Is it like vending machines? Is it a car wash? Is it a laundromat? Like, what can I do? And I opened a skincare retail store. I invested $50,000 in that in Ponte Vedra Beach. My husband opened his own construction company. And so that's where we were in life when I was asked to take a look at this. And I was asked to give my feedback on the nutrition side of it because our family had just been hit with a doozy. And I have the belief that most people really into health and nutrition are into health and nutrition because something has happened in their life that made them go, I need to dig into this a little bit more. Maybe I'm not gonna listen to everything the doctors say and I'm gonna go do research on my own. So my sister was told, your son will never speak. He will never have more than the mind of a three-year-old. He will always be in diapers. And I had a nine-month-old, and I have a master's degree in research. And I'm like, uh-uh, I'm going to go research this. And when I began to research, I began to understand the importance of what we put into our bodies and how we're being poisoned every day with the food that we're consuming. And it scared me to death. I made my poor husband create an organic garden for me in our backyard. I bought one of those really big expensive juicers. How many of you have one of those hidden somewhere in your pantry? Really hard to clean, so hard to clean you never wanna use it. So all my organic vegetables would go bad because I would never use the juicer. And so that's kind of where I was. I also would go to Native Sun and I'd turn the vitamin bottles over and the guy who works behind the counter there, you know, the 18 year old who makes minimum wage, he would be like, can I help you, man? No, no, thank you. No, thank you. I know what I'm looking for, okay? so I would picking out the best of the best and doing all of that, seeing no changes, when I was called and said, will you take a look at this? I'm like, I have no time on my plate to look at anything, no. We just want your advice, your opinion on the nutrition side of it, okay. 
So I started looking and immediately I recognized that they were speaking truth. I met Nancy the other day. She is also a PA. She recognized immediately that we were speaking truth. Laura, I haven't even met you yet. You said, I love this stuff already. I know you know your stuff about nutrition. I have a feeling. Otherwise you wouldn't say, I know, your, I, know I like this already. If you know your stuff about nutrition, you take a little look at it and you're like, whoa, this is, this is good stuff right here. Tim grew up in Seattle, he was drinking green juice from the age of two all the way up. Kara, his wife, took it to him and he said, this is really good stuff, okay? So we've got the room full of people like that. That was me. So I call in the morning and I say, give me everything they have. They were like, everything? Everything. And so we get all these boxes and my husband's like, what is all this stuff? I'm like, I don't know. There were no videos, there was no one teaching me. We just started consuming all of it. And I'm just gonna tell you, we had life-changing results. Life-changing results. The first week we had results that made us kind of be like, is it really the products? Like, does it really work that fast? And then two weeks in, I'm like, gosh, this is weird. And then three months in, people started to recognize changes in us. And I'm too much of an analytical clinician to ignore that. I uh, walked away from practicing medicine in December of 2019 because of what I'm sharing with you today. I have found a better way to help people. You don't have to be sick. Your parents don't have to be sick. Your kids don't have to be sick. We have a better way. I have loads of videos online teaching about that. I'm gonna give you the premise, but we have some really amazing speakers tonight that you guys are gonna to get to hear from because most of you have heard me way too much. The premise of the company and why it started, the philosophy that drew me in is why I'm really here today. And I believe this with all of my heart, that the majority of the health issues we face as a human race are the result of us being toxic, out of balance, and lacking in nutrition. Let's talk about the toxicity, okay? We are, all of you are old enough to remember putting le leftover turkey dinner or lasagna in a Tupperware container, sticking it in the microwave with some plastic wrap on type top and eating what comes out, okay? We're being poisoned. Herbicides, pesticides, fungicides, all in your body, all backing up so that when you put something good in your body, can't even absorb it. Just imagine taking your car in for the oil change and them not getting rid of the old sludge oil, them just putting new good oil on top. Would your car run well? No, it would not make it 200,000 miles. What makes you think you can make it 90 to 100 years walking and happy if you're not cleansing the junk out, okay? Out of balance. Very few, how many of you got, now I know this is a peer group, how many of you got eight hours of sleep last night? Raise your hand. Very small percentage, okay? If I, if I pull the average, like if I go to Providence where my kids go to school and I pull the teachers there, I know probably not one got eight hours of sleep last night, okay? Very few actually exercised today. When you don't exercise, your lymph system backs up. That causes you to be more toxic, like a cesspool of toxicity, okay? A lot of children aren't sleeping enough. We're staring at what too much? We all know we're doing it. It's not gonna change. I hate to say it, it's not gonna change. We're staring at this, we're not moving. And then on top of that, we're extremely acidic. And I'm gonna talk about that in just a moment. And then we're undernourished. You know, fast food has become what we do. You know, the kids are eating, just go to the lunchrooms. Lunchables, Oreos, gummy bears, sodas for lunch. We're not feeding and sustaining our bodies the way we should be. Some of you are like, no, no, I eat organic, I'm healthy. I have that organic juicer, I do all of that. Well, studies have shown that we are not consuming what our grandparents used to consume. A study in 2010 showed that they had for one orange, one bushel of spinach, one carrot, one apple, we have to eat like between eight to 88 of each of those things to get the same amount of nutrition. That's a study published 12 years ago. Do you think it's worse or better since 2010? It's worse, okay? So, the answer is a centuries-old philosophy, and this is what caught my attention. Centuries-old. Genesis 129 says everything we need comes from the ground. That's the oldest book of wisdom. Everything we need for this to run the way we're supposed to run comes from the ground. The centuries-old philosophy is cleanse your body of the toxins, balance out, balance out your pH naturally, balance out your, your sleep, balance out your exercise, build your cells up with good nutrition, and you will run the way you were supposed to run. So let me give you this picture. This is how you're supposed to function. This is how God made us, right here at this place. Every time you get less than eight hours of sleep, you're over here. Drink a cup of coffee for breakfast, you're over here. You had some bacon for breakfast this morning, over here. 
You didn't exercise today, over here. Now what's over here? This is where your body is ripe for disease and infection. Viruses, bacteria, all over you. Someone said to me today, Rachel, how come, how come I haven't gotten a certain virus that's floating around? I'm like, I'm not a good host. My body's not a good host. I'm not over here. I'm over here. Now most people think, well, how do I get over there? What our system does is it pours plant-based nutrition in. It cleanses the toxins out so that your body can function the way that it's made to. If you are not pouring plants, plants, and more plants into your body, you will be in a state of acidity. You're in a state of acidity, a lot of studies have proven your body is a good host for viruses and bacteria. If you're in a state of acidity, your body wants to get over here. It's an amazing machine. It's gonna leach the alkalinity out of your teeth and your bones. I talk about this book all the time, largest human population study ever done to find out why are there people who live into their hundreds and you've heard of the blue zones where people live into well into their hundreds, gardening, exercising, climbing cliffs, like all kinds of stuff. And then you go to Disney World and look at the webcams and you got all these 40 year olds in wheelchairs. What's the difference? It's food, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. One group is eating plants, plants, and more plants. The other group is eating meat, dairy, sugar, soda, coffee, bread. I don't have to tell you which group was the healthy group, do I? So what we have here is a way for you to cleanse, pour all that plant-based nutrition in very easily. In the, in the morning, it can take 30 seconds. I'm gonna show you a video of my boys. They've been doing it since they were babies. In 30 seconds in the morning, they get more nutrition in their body than their entire class gets in a week. They're not good hosts either. Their bodies are functioning the way they're supposed to function. So there's a lot of stuff up here, but typically anybody who works closely with me knows that I talk a lot about the core complete. Most of, how many of you are using the core complete? Raise your hand, okay? The core complete, what we found, I've been doing this for 14 years, and people used to be like, ah, I'm just gonna try the mango stain, or ah, I'm just gonna try the sulfur. Everybody talks about how great the sulfur is. And I've learned, because I'm, an, I'm a researcher, there are certain things that when people just take one of them, they don't respond very well. And there are certain things on the table that when they do all of them, their body responds very well. And it's because you're cleansing, balancing, and building. And most of us are missing a bunch of nutrition. So the core complete, there's a picture of it. I can walk through it. I do it on videos. I'm not gonna do it right now. There's six things that people typically notice when they start taking it. What most people do is they do it for 30 days. There's a 30 day satisfaction guarantee offered by the company. That's a pretty big deal. You don't get that from most places that offer supplementation or food for that matter. Six things typically happen. Weight loss without trying, better sleep, loads of energy, decrease in pain, improvement in bowel habits. It should look like a Wendy's Frosty when you go to the bathroom. There should be no magazines in there. When you go, you go and it's out. Okay, and mood improvement. But you don't notice your mood, do you guys? Everyone around you does. It's why I think the women oftentimes start with the products, and then by the end of the month, the men are stealing the women's products. Why would that be? Because they notice the change in their women, and they're like, I think I need some of that. <laughs> <laughs> so, 30-day guarantee, most people start with this, and then they choose their two to three that they love going forward. The average person spends about $100 to $150 a month on their supplementation. The average educated person is spending to $100 to $150 a month on their supplementation. My question to you is, does it work? Can you tell when you take it? Can you tell when you don't? There's people in here taking vitamins that you got from GNC. Can you tell when you take it when you don't? If you go on a ski trip and don't bring your vitamins, are you gonna freak out? If you take pure products, you will freak out. You will freak out, okay? But if you're spending money on something that you can't tell when you don't take it, I'm glad you're here. Because I feel that whatever you have, we have better. Mm -hmm. What we have is better. So if you're here tonight and you're not supplementing, you need to be. I believe everybody in this room should be a customer of this company, okay? It's just a membership club. That's all it is. It's like Costco, okay? But you don't have to go there. It's a membership club that gives you discount products that in my opinion actually end up being cheaper than what you're probably buying already, but you'll get results, okay? so. That's the core complete. I'm gonna show you, I promised you, my little guy, every morning, 30 seconds, downs it. More nutrition than his whole class gets in a week, okay? I actually have another video. This is because they're grown and I cry about it every day because I can't snuggle with them anymore. Well, I can, it's weird. So these are my boys in the morning, shoving it down every morning. 
They just take, they take everything I'm showing, the core complete. They shove it down every single morning, okay? So for those of you who think that's too much, it's too hard, no, it's not. And it's not your teacher's job or your doctor's job to get this nutrition in your kids. He's eating Mila muffins. They have Mila in them, high amounts of omega-3s. Go research omega-3s tonight. You will never go another day. If he knew I was showing this, he would, I would not, I would not be spoken to for two weeks. So, um, and my, okay, there we go. So what is this? It's e-commerce, online shopping. How many of you bought something online in the last three months? If you don't raise your hand, you are a liar, <laughs> okay? Because we just went through Christmas. Amazon, you know those Amazon packages come, you're like, woohoo! You know, we all bought toilet paper online a year and a half ago. You all bought something online. It's just online shopping. The company decided to take out the middleman. When they started this company 15 years ago, most companies like this end in five years. Heck, most, most companies that start end in five years. We're 15 years old. They said, we're not gonna pay a marketing firm for billboards and commercials and radio ads. We're just gonna pay people who love our stuff. We're gonna give them a referral fee for sending people this direction, okay? I was telling people last night, the eyelashes I have on, they're not real. I, if I refer somebody to them, get a, dis get a discount on my next set of eyelashes. We're doing this all the time. My hair stylist offers a discount. If I refer someone to her, we're referring people to stuff all the time. If you recommend it to Elisha, who's new to our community, where to go eat tomorrow, okay, are you gonna send her somewhere where she's gonna get food poisoning? No. You're gonna send her to a place where you like the food. Are you gonna get paid for sending her there? No. We do this every day. She's gonna ask us for the dentist around town that we recommend. You're gonna send her to a good dentist. The dentist is not gonna give you a fee or a referral fee or a commission. We are recommending stuff all the time, friends. That's all that this is. Most of you in here will never tell anyone about it. I've been doing this 14 years. I know what I'm talking about, okay? You'll be drinking our energy drink, which really should be called Focus. It's plant brain food. It dials you in for six to eight hours. You'll be drinking it. Someone will be like, what are you drinking? Oh, nothing. Why? Because you don't want to be one of those people. You don't want to sell anything. I don't want to make money. God forbid I'm doing something that makes money. We all talk so bad about money, right, and how bad it is, but I hate to break it to you, money ranks right up there with oxygen. You have to have it. You can't take your trips, you can't spend your time with your kids. Lindley and I were just talking about this today. Um, her son was sniffly, wasn't feeling too good, so we stayed home. And he came out, I was there at her house, he came out around 11.30 from the bedroom, and she was like, oh, I forgot you were here. And I was like, you know what? This is going on all over the country right now where kids are staying home sick. Any of you, if you've experienced this, raise your hand. Has a child stayed home sick in the last year? Okay, what does the average person do who works a full-time job? Amy and Bobby, you guys have to get up and go to work every day. What do you do? Like, can you call in? Do they have to stay home? And Palmer's old enough to stay home. I'm like, but it stinks to be 13 years old and home with a fever without your mom. So what, what are we doing? Because of what Lindley and David have done with this company in the last three years, they don't even have to worry about that. They're home with their kids whenever they want to be. So the ability to create an additional stream of income, you guys, I do not believe it's a luxury like we thought it was years ago. I believe it's a necessity now. Everyone should have another stream of income. You don't know when you're gonna lose your job, okay? So most people in here though, you're not gonna ever tell anybody about that. And I'm totally cool with it. And whoever invited you is totally cool with that. We want you to consume the products because they're life-changing and we know you're gonna love them. 30 day satisfaction guarantee. That's all that this company is. Now I stand up here and talk about them because after 14 years of recommending them to others, I have seen thousands of lives change. I've seen tens of thousands of lives change. I went to medical school, Nancy went to medical school to help people. Anybody else here in the healthcare world? Raise your hand. It's changed. Teresa knows, she's in the, she's in the hospital all the time. And she just texted me last week and said, I've never seen so many people under the age of 50 on the cardiac floor in all of my years of nursing. It has changed, okay? And it, the people in the healthcare world and the people in the schools are exhausted. They're exhausted. I have found something that I can do when I want to do it and I can help people. That's why I went to school is to help people. I can't believe that I get paid to do this. I can't believe that I get paid to share this information. So in the beginning, I just like, threw bags of Mila and threw stuff at people. And over time I started saying, I need to figure out how to really do this so that anybody can do it. So now I stand up here, not because I work for the company, but because I believe in the company so much that I believe everybody should have a membership with Pure to get these products because I know how life-changing they are. So let me tell you a little bit about them. 
Third party testing. The majority of the products that you see at Walgreens or CVS, there's no third party testing. They can put vitamin D on the back label and never have tested to see that there's even vitamin D in there. Third party testing on everything you see here. Many of our products are listed in the physician's desk reference. That's what I use for 20 years to write prescriptions. Okay? And then FDA registered facilities. People will go, are they FDA approved? Oh, that's just a loaded sentence, isn't it? But I'll just say this. Foods and supplements are not FDA approved. Prescriptions are. I no longer write prescriptions. Thank God. So, no, but we have FDA registered facilities that a lot of companies don't, that the products all, they come from all over the world. Our chia is grown in multiple regions near the equator. If your chia is from Gainesville, Florida, there's no omega-3s in them. You're basically buying seeds. They give you fiber, which is fine, but the power here is the omega-3s. Who, who, who started this company? Who's invested in this company? What's it all about? One of our investors, our majority investor, is Phil Knight founder of the largest shoe company in the world. I have had people hear that and say I'm in because they did business with him 20 years ago. All right, so big time investors, deep pockets. I will tell you, we've never gone on social media until the last 12 months. So we all have friends that you log on and you see them selling their oils or their makeup or their whatever. We all know, you're thinking about it right now, right? You've never probably seen a pure thing online unless you're Jen Von Hagen's friend. Right. Otherwise, you've never <laughs> seen pure online, okay? Because We've never trained, I'm on the Leadership Advisory Council, we've never trained social media before. So less than 50,000 people in the entire United States of America even know this company exists. There's 2.1 million people within 50 miles of where we're standing right now. If all 50,000 were right here, we would have 2.1 million people to tell in Jacksonville. Most people are just gonna consume, a few will decide, I have to tell people. You're already thinking about your mom or your sister or your brother or your brother-in-law. This business model is recommended by some of the most brilliant models of our time, but brilliant entrepreneurs and money makers of our time. There are interviews online you can find of Tony Robbins and Richard Branson saying, this business model is the best business model to get started in to create a residual income stream with very low investment and very part-time effort, okay? Now, I'm gonna pause and bring some speakers up because many of you have heard me speak way too many times and you could do this presentation in your sleep. So you get tired of hearing from Rachel, but there are some fabulous, fabulous people here tonight. So I'm actually gonna start by bringing up the president of our company, Mike Wade. I am gonna bring you up first, unless you don't want me to. Is that all right? That's, that's an audible. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna start by bringing the president of our company, Mike Wade. I've got, I've got a number of speakers tonight, but this guy is um, awesome. And I'm so glad that he's here. He made the trip. He was in uh, Albany and Bainbridge last week, right? right? Thomasville right. last night. He's gonna be going to Montana for one of my teams. I'm going to Montana in two weeks. He's going two weeks after me. Traveling all around, trying to spread the news. So why is what he has to say important? So he's the president of our company. He's been in this industry for how long? 27 years. 27 years. And he that still- That means I'm old, okay? <laughs> Do the math. Still getting on planes and coming out to train, to teach to get people to understand the power of what we have our hands on. I feel blessed that he's here to share tonight. We're gonna to get to hear a number of other testimonies from people like me who started and saw a presentation, decided to share, but I would love for you to share a little okay, bit tonight. Okay, I'll do it. Thank, Thank you. you. There's Give a Rachel white, a hand for all this. There's this a whiteboard 